What is the mileage of this 2010 Toyota Yaris? Mr. President of the United States of America. Tell him what the mileage is. Somewhere between 700 billion and a trillion 300 million. Hmm. Not close enough. How about you, Mr. President of Nigeria? 769,810. God! <laughs> 700, listen properly, 769,820. <clears throat> Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Uh? Get out of here. 246,000 miles, guys. 2010 Toyota Yaris, I'm the first owner and also the only owner. I passed down to my kid and recently she just kicked it back to me because she didn't want to pay for gas. So this car has over 246,000 miles on it, very close to 250,000 miles. It's been neglected. You can see all the, uh, the dents and all that stuff bird crap left out in the sun i mean she only used it just to drive just to get to places but there was no care involved there's no love and relationship or emotional attachment to this uh, vehicle she's not a car enthusiast she just basically needs a car to get to places and hang out with her friends so This car is burning oil. How much? I don't know. I asked my daughter, oh, how much is burning oil? She goes, I don't know. And the more I ask her, the more she says, I don't remember. So you know what? Don't ask your kid anything about cars. Just do it yourself. So what I did is I resetted my odometer, my trip odometer. I filled up the gas and um, I checked out the tailpipe. There's no evidence that there's blue smoke, black smoke coming out of the tailpipe. It's clean. It smells good too. I mean, it'll pass smog. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. So I filled up the oil to the top dot, filled it up with gas, and I reset the odometer. And I'm gonna let it run, or I'm gonna use it for 300 miles and to see how much oil it's consuming. And there is no oil leak, mind you, in this car. I mean, this is Toyota built. Toyota is known for this. I mean, what I'm trying to say is, when Toyota builds a car, it's supposed to last forever. This car has over 246,000 miles. Not kilometers, but miles. So, I'm gonna find out how much it's using, how many quarts of oil it's using after running it for 300 miles and then from there I'm gonna try to do some DIY do-it-yourself fix this car and hopefully I can minimize the uh, consumption of the oil but it is very normal for cars to consume oil uh, especially Toyota oh well new cars this is a 2010 and I know about 2005 the EPA started cracking down on gas cars. They wanted less emission, so Toyota had no choice but to loosen up the, the oil rings. So there's less drag on the piston. So minimizing the emission uh, that it puts out. And a lot of people don't know that. Now, how do I know this? Because I used to be a journeyman, auto mechanic, certified ASE. Um, and I made a living out of it. I bought my first house being as an auto mechanic. So I'm not a tree shade mechanic. I wasn't a tree shade mechanic and I wasn't a, a backyard mechanic. I went to school, I got my uh, certification and I got my experience in several um, shops and then I worked for the government as an auto mechanic, as a journeyman. 
and uh, I, well, I left that field for more money. So I love being an auto mechanic, but the name of the game is how much money can I put in my pocket so I can live a better life. That's the name of the game. So guys, so follow me on this channel and let's let's dig into this Toyota 2010 Toyota Yaris automatic transmission. problem with oil consumption. Once again, this is Judge Fred Tagalog and I welcome you to my channel about automotives and things like that, like automotives, electrical, electronics, or whatever. Peace out, guys. Smoke, baby.